The general term of a sequence is given by a sub n equals 70 plus 5 times the quantity n minus 8, where a sub 0 is the initial value. Who cares? Which of the following expression also gives the general term of the sequence? So, I don't know. Let's... Let's do a little bit of distributive, a little bit of combining like terms and see what happens. We get 70 plus 5 times n minus 8. All I'm doing is just rewriting the original equation without the a sub n part. Let's distribute 5. So 70 plus 5n minus 40. Let's combine like terms. So 70 minus 40 is going to be 30, and I get 5n plus 30, or in this case, 30 plus 5n, because they're giving us the old switcherooski, and that's going to give me the answer of b. So, yeah, not, not a difficult problem, not by any stretch.